Okay, so I think night before last, I was watching, look, clicking on bit my subscription to see who was on there, and I saw Lorraine, the current custom, and she was doing a small haul, and I just enjoyed so much looking at her beautiful little baby boy. So I clicked on there, and she was showing these tops that she got at Express. And Express is one of those places I typically don't walk in there. I don't go on their website. Something has to usually draw me in there because I feel like most things are too um, junior or too too short, too tight, everything for me. But she showed these tops, and they are just like little tanks um, with a peplum, but not a extreme peplum just it's just a little flare at the bottom and then the back has this zipper which i love zippers and seams and everything in the back i love a back detail and they were buy one get one for 9.99 and one of them is 30 so they're 20 bucks a piece and um at first i did not know if they would work for me because i'm long-waisted and a lot of times peplum tops won't work for me they won't hit in the right area and the girl checking me out was very long-waisted also, and she said that she wore them, so that's why I went ahead and got it. And they do run a little bit small, because a lot of times in Express, I do wear a small, but these, I got a medium, and they're none too big. So um, I got this color, which is like a periwinkle in the medium, and I tried it on last night, and they do hit, they don't, I mean, like this part does not like sit on my hips or anything and then flare out across my behind. They do kind of hit like right about here, but I think that is okay for these because I'm probably just going to wear them with jeans or a skirt or something. I'm not really going for that full peplum look. It's, um, I think it's going to be okay. So, um, I got that one and, um, of course they had black. You know, all kinds of solid colors. They had black, cream, white, but I was trying to get something a little different and I liked this color. And it's like a, um, kind of a, maybe a sea foam kind of green with navy. And I thought it would look good with white jeans, especially like my white destroyed jeans or even high-waisted jeans. It would look good with those too. So, look good with anything actually. And um, so that's all I got there. So another place that we went into yesterday, no trip to the mall is complete without a stop in Forever 21. And I got something that I didn't think I would ever get. And I, for some reason, have a little thing in my head about Capri leggings. And I think that the reason is, for some reason, I just feel like they're, um, frumpy is not the word, but my grandmother used to always wear capris and it just i just think about that that length you know right i love things that are cropped but that length right you know past the knee but i have seen so many girls lately wearing these capri length just black leggings with just like big t-shirts and flip-flops and it looks so cute it's just something else casual and cute to wear so they weren't out i had to ask the guy if he had any of the capri length leggings and he brought them out and he brought me two pair he said they're um buy one what do you say get they're two for ten dollars is what it was i guess it's buy one for um 580 or two for ten dollars so i said well i'll take them both because i figured it would be senseless not to and um they feel really nice i think this is one of those things you can buy at forever 21 and it's not that especially for the summertime you don't need any and it's not for exercise or whatever so anyway, I think, I'm thinking I'm going to wear these with that free people black top and just my black Javianas, and I think that'll look cute. Or just any of those big um, oversized tanks that you have to wear something under, or just anything. So I'll wear this soon in an outfit of the day and let you make up your mind if, if you're like me and have hang-ups. Or if you wear these in a way that you really like, let me know below. Let me know some different ideas. So I got those. And then Brooke and I had gone to Target sometime last week and I picked up this skirt. It was actually, I probably wouldn't have gotten it, but it was on the one of the ads, ad boards. A girl had this skirt on with a gray tank and it looked so good. And I put it on at first today and I was going to put a gray tank on with it, but it was kind of too dressy for what we're going to do today. 
So, um, but it's a, like a maxi skirt with that ruching that kind of goes on the side. You see, that's the back. And then it um, is very flattering, and then it has that slit that's not too high. It's just a little, probably up to right below your knee. Just really cute. But it's not lined or anything, which it's black, so that helps. And I got the medium, and that seems to fit. And I'm about a six or an eight right now. A bigger six or a smaller an eight. Okay, smaller and then eight. I got the skirt that I'm wearing now, but I'll show you that in my outfit of the day. And I love this one that I have on. Um, the one I have on is lined. It has like a built-in, I'll show you. And then I saw this on their table. I think it was actually on sale. We were getting Brooke some little, we've been getting her church clothes, some little sundresses and skirts. Um, we bought her, um, I see I bought her a cute little pair of flats at Target. Anyway, a couple of little flats everywhere. And um, I was getting her her and I both like to have little sweaters or something to put on at church and when we go out to eat because it gets so cold. And I believe these were on sale for 20 And I got the large because I wanted it to be big, but it's just a long, um, I guess you could call it a boyfriend type sweater. When I think of a boyfriend sweater, for some reason I think thicker, but it's just this kind of sweater. It has like the sleeves are pretty much three quarter length, but not, you still can bunch them up. And, um, it's similar to the Free People sweater I got, but not as long, not as trendy looking, but still for 20 bucks or whatever it was. Let's see what it says on here. I don't think it says the price. It says Heather Gray Large. Anyway, Massimo is the brand. I just thought it would be good to wear, like you could even wear this um, and the leggings and like a um, flowy tank top and flats or something like that. Okay, I've and, got one more thing, um, but I'm going to do my outfit of the day, and then I'll show you. It's an accessory, so I'll show you at the end. I'll be right back. This is the skirt I was telling you about from Target, and I love it. It is a just kind of a classic um, chevron, you know, pencil skirt, but what I love about it is it has this built-in slip. That makes everything better. I love a slip, and it really stays down. It's... Um, and it's a good length it's past the knees even though I've got it pulled up and I've just got it on with a James purse tank um, this little um, jean vest is Levi's and I got it last year at the outlet and a little tip on this you will notice that I probably couldn't button this if I tried but I have noticed that if you want to wear um, a vest or something and you want it to be open and show your Sure, a lot of times you have to get a little bit smaller size. Otherwise, to me, they just kind of, um, they just take over and they don't open, they kind of stay closed. So that's just a little tip there. And I love the way a vest does in the back. It kind of gives you even more shape. And um, so the shoes, shoes I'm wearing today are the um, Gianni Beanie Zip It Wedges and just they're very comfortable i think some other ones might have looked a little bit better but these are very comfortable as you can see my legs are white because i have not been tanning i've been trying to um i've gotten a little bit of sun in the real sun but i haven't been using my tanning lotion because it seems to make the um you know the spots and everything on my legs look worse so anyway that's the shoes i'm wearing and um the purse I'm carrying is my Balenciaga, let's see, classic, I guess it's the Giant City. I'm not sure what it's called, but it's got the rose gold hardware, and um, the color is Rose Thulian. I was just noticing how long this video is, so I might split it up between makeup and clothes and accessories, so I don't want to hurry. Um, yesterday, when we were walking to Belk, I walked past the Sunglass Hut, little place in the mall and um, I always look over there and usually I've gotten to the point where I've just about gotten everything that I want but I always look at the Ray-Bans and they had these and they're just so classic and when I put them on it was like Cinderella putting on her slipper not that I think they look just so great but they feel they fit my face so well and they are the Ray-Ban just I think it's called the Clubmaster and these are sunglasses kind of like um, aviators. They just will Here never they go out of are, style. And I think that they probably look better 
I don't know. They looked better yesterday. It seems like when I had my bangs going, but I think that they are, they, I don't know if you can see how well, see how they don't sit on my cheeks. So if you have that problem, um, then they might be something that you would like to try. And I think that they're just classic. I love them. They're kind of, um, old Hollywood, I think, or sixties or something. I just love them and they fit so well. They're very, very substantial feeling. They're not, um, you know how the Ray-Bans are so light feeling. They're just really pretty and I loved the black and gold. They had some other colors like a gray and um, bronze, but several of them weren't polarized and um, I wanted to get polarized if I could. So when she said black and gold, I was like, perfect, because that's very classic looking. So I'm gonna wear these today and I love them. <laughs> so um, I hope you guys have a good weekend. I don't know if I'll be back. I think my friend Mary will come back and stay with me. She's actually staying at a beach that's about an hour away up the coast or down the coast a little bit. And um, her parents or her family rents a beach house. And so she came up to see me for that day. And I believe she's gonna come up and spend tomorrow and tomorrow night with me too. So I don't know if I'll get to make a video, but I will see you next week and I should be kind of in the swing of so, things. So I hope you guys have a good weekend. I will quit yammering on and um, I will see yeah, you I soon. just realized Bye -bye. I forgot to, I got so excited about my glasses, I forgot to tell you about the rest of my accessories, which you probably know about everything, but just in case. I've got on these bracelets, which are all um, Sheila Fajal and they're that same material that she makes out the earrings out of so they're real light and easy to wear um that is getting better and i've had so many of you give me great suggestions for like scar creams and tell me to keep sunscreen on it and i do matter of fact you can see i usually keep a band-aid on it when we go in the sun and um so that's getting better and um I just, I'm so glad that other thing's gone. I don't care. <laughs> and um, nail polish, like I've told you, is the Chanel Vamp. Um, this is my St. Kilda's Love Ring that John got me years and years ago. Um, this is an old band that I had. This was my grandmother's, my dad's mom's baby ring. And I just wear it there. And wedding ring and the Buddha girl bangles, and mine are the ones with the Lord's Prayer. It has like a cross and stuff right there. So, and I love these. They're the all weather bangles, and they are they're awesome. They are just comfortable. They don't make a lot of noise. They're soft. They just don't bug you in any way. They're worth it. I've had several people ask me were they worth the price, and I think they are just because I wear them so much. And I got the small. And they do, you know, they are somewhat hard to get off my hand, but I think they're pretty much supposed to be that way. So, there you go. It's not like they hurt because they're soft. Okay, that's it. See you soon. Bye-bye.